righty, I have a somewhat sad video, depending on how you view the ride. Um, and again, this video is pure speculation and rumors. Nothing is confirmed until the park makes an announcement. Um, but we are definitely getting a huge hunch that Orbiter will not be opening in the 2019 season. So, um, basically from <laughs> what we're seeing, pieces of Orbiter have been getting removed. Um, we've been seeing arms being dismantled. We've been seeing the carts get removed. We've been seeing people removing stuff from the op booth. Um, from the drone, um, and this is normal and not normal at the same time. Normally they remove the carts for maintenance, um, but not arms, not equipment, not stuff like that. We don't see cars parked there all day. Um, so we've been noticing this for the past three times that we've been flying the drone, um, and now we're seeing some parts of the fence coming down. Um, so I'm going to make a huge leap and going to reach really far, and I'm going to assume that Orbiter will not be opening for the 2019 season, and it is being removed um, and I have a feeling this has to do with probably maintenance cost and uh, to make way for a future attraction. Orbiter was probably going to close at the end of the 2019 season if I was to make a wild speculative guess right now. Um, and uh, then in 2020, they would do construction for something for 2021. Um, that would be my wild guess. And then cost and everything came into effect and they just decided to remove it early. We're seeing that with Cedar Fair. Um, they're just removing attractions early, um, or attractions that cost too much to run. And I, Orbiter is definitely up there for any of you that know it opens at 12 PM last season, um, daily, um, sometimes 11, 12 PM. Um, so they were definitely having problems with it. Uh, it was down sometimes for long periods of time. So the ride's probably not going to open for 2019. And that's my assumption. This is definitely speculation. Again, take this with a huge grain of salt. Uh, but I drew up something that, uh, I think could be going on. So as you know, I mentioned something about 2021. Um, so I'm assuming that Orbiter is the, I'm not assuming, the red circled plot of land is Orbiter. Yellow is the station, break run, lift hill, and turn on Mindbuster. Now, if we saw and take into account what happened at Carowinds when they removed their wooden coaster because their water park was in need of an expansion, for those of you that attend Wonderland, you know that their water park is in need of an expansion. People are literally sitting like in the dirt underneath trees. It's overcrowded um, and it needs to expand. And I drew up what could possibly go on. So the blue represents a water park expansion. The yellow and red combined could resemble, you know, maybe a ground up RMC or more importantly, uh, a mock double launch coaster could fit perfectly in there. Um, so who really knows what's going to go on? I don't know um, what kind of coaster they're going to get in 2021 at all yet. Have no where to even begin speculating on what's going on with 2021 and what type of coaster they'll get. But my two guesses would be RMC, or three guesses would be RMC, GCI conversion if they don't want the water park expansion, or a mock double launch coaster as the third one. I am going to start leaning towards a mock double launch coaster in that area, as it would complement Frontier Canada um, significantly, and I think it would fit in really nicely. Um, just something mock, even maybe a mock spinning coaster, uh, family spinning coaster in that area, anything mock or um, something to fit in with Frontier Canada in terms of that. It's very difficult to predict three years in advance when you don't even have anything to go off of. So those would be my three guesses. It's going to be either RMC, GCI, or a mock coaster of some sort. Anyways, I wanted to update you guys on the things we were seeing. Um, I know someone in our videos actually noticed yesterday um, what was going on with Orbiter, and uh, we've been watching it for three days now. And I think I'm ready to call it that Orbiter won't be opening for the 2019 season. I'm almost certain. But again, even though I'm almost certain, I'm just an individual making YouTube videos on Canada's Wonderland. And I'm basing this as off of things that I'm seeing. And it's pure speculation and rumors until the park makes an announcement. I'm sure the park will make an announcement if it's going to close. If it's not going to close, then it's just in for significant um, maintenance. Um, but yes, I'm definitely getting ready to predict that this ride will not be opening for the 2019 season. And I wanted to update you guys. So now I want to hear from you guys down below. What do you think could be replacing Orbiter in the 2020 season or 2021 season? Will it be a flat ride, um, a mock double launch coaster, a GCI conversion of Mindbuster or an RMC ground up or RMC conversion? What do you think is going to happen in this plot of land? It's a very big plot of land. Even keeping Mindbuster out of the equation, it can fit 
two flat rides um, if they really wanted to. So it'll be interesting to see what happens with Orbiter's plot of land. Anyways, hopefully you guys really enjoyed this quick update video on Orbiter. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't, and share this video for others to watch. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one. Bye.